guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting ring to episode 13 of So I'm a Spider, So What? So it's gonna get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Please do not be a recap episode, I swear to God. My child, are we finally out of this fucking cave? Are you fucking kidding me? You're surrounded by walls. What, you could- uh, Huh? Uh -uh. Yeah, they see you as the big dangerous thing that they want to kill. Huh. Oh! Huh. Oh, we get a new opening too. Yay! So the one thing that I now want to see for the second half of this series. Oh, I'm really <laughs> I want to go back and forth between them once again. But I want to see more adventures with Shen. I'm just saying it would be nice if they do that. Who knows if it's going to happen. Don't half-ass it, please. I never would have thought I would have seen the demon lord fighting against the spider, but okay. <laughs> Oh my god, I've missed this. <laughs> oh, what's with the, yeah. <sighs> I don't, if, if this is supposed to be a reference to, oh my god, what's that damn movie? Um, The Sound of Music. <laughs> Where the fucking the hells are alive. <laughs> Seriously? You can involve oh again! <laughs> oh my god. 
Hmm? Are you hungry? Mm. Don't eat the butterfly. Hmm? The spider sense is tingling. Kin control. Oh, that's some bullshit. Ignore it. Something. I don't care. You are not going back into that cave. Do you know how long it took you to get out of that cave? I don't want another 12 weeks of you coming out of the cave again and then possibly going back into it. Yeah. She would have been out of the egg by now. Oh yeah, if Julius was still alive, I think Julius would be out be doing all that. Hmm? Mm -hmm. Yeah, don't blame yourself. But he has to. It's his destiny, though. You can't just baby him all the time. Plus, I mean, honestly, yeah, I don't want him to do it just as much as anyone else, but he has to, no matter what you do.
Yeah. It's a lot of responsibility. Oh. Of course. Mm -hmm. Let's just hope everything will be okay. <laughs> figures you would come back. See, this is also why we should have killed him, but no. I know we need him for the plot, but... I love the fact in this series he's a complete and total asshole, but then you watch S.H.I.E.L.D. hero and he's just, you know, also somewhat of an asshole, but you know, he's a hero asshole. But he's sweet. <laughs> Why do they gotta run so fast? Like, oh my god, no. Between spiders and cockroaches. Like, no, just kill him. Since the other spiders, oh shit! Ha! Can you even take on all of them? Oh my god, honey. I can't. Uh. 
Of course. I mean, you would also think because they're much bigger than her, they would be a lot slower. But no, they are literally at the same pace as her. They're going to get out. Of course. And there goes the HP. Sad day. <laughs> well, at least that's food. I don't know how you would feel about eating your own sibling, but, um... Because don't spiders eat, like... If it's not spiders, it's something. It's some insect. They they eat their offspring or their husband or something. And I, and I think that's crazy, but you know, a. Hey, you gotta do what you gotta do, right? I mean, you could just put... Oh, I don't even think she has an inventory. So, yeah, of course she has to just eat everything right then and there. Of course. Are you? Huh? Huh? <laughs> 
Yeah. Exactly. How are you 100% sure that this is going to work? See, now you're acting like Nadoka Madoka. Honey, you can't do that. Like, no. You need to. Yeah, hell no. You ain't even acting like those. So you acting like Futaba today. I know we're almost done with this episode. Yeah, we got like two minutes left. I'm not going to show that whole fight. That's it? Oh, okay. All right. So, I mean, for a return episode, this is really good. I mean, yes, my child is finally out of the damn cave. 12 fucking weeks and then you know a break later this chick is finally out and she is able to breathe in nice smelling good air flowers trees grass she can touch the grass you know go outside and touch some damn grass feel that grass mmm so good okay shun my baby shun this is a lot of responsibility on him and I get the fact that Sue and what's her face are very you know um, worried about him. Really more of Sue. The fact that those two also got captured by you-know-who, that asshole. Of course that makes sense, so I'm guessing, given about two, three episodes, he's eventually going to find out and he's going to have to go after them and such. And so, of course, we're going to have my child, Hacker, aka also the kid from M4 of I Cut Two Stars, and Ida slash, um, Nalfami. Duke it out once again. <laughs> I don't know how that's gonna go, but I, I, something tells me that they're probably going to kill um, Ida slash Nalfami Seiyu's character, possibly. I mean, because it makes the most sense, because I didn't like him in the first half of the show, and I don't even like him even now. So, if we get a point where him and Shun do have to fight, it's gonna be to the death. Why would you want to work with him, though? Explain. Like, seriously. You can't leave with that little end credit scene and expect me to wait until next Friday. Do you know how long of a wait that is? It's a whole fucking week. We can't do that. No. No. No, 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 no. What the hell are you doing, Joe? No, you t what is this fuckery? Because this is some good fuckery. Like, mm, this ain't cool. Like, with that, especially with that damn ending. Like, no, you cannot do that. That is so messed up. But whatever it means, out of all the people, why would one of his brothers want to work with him? So are we saying that he's also a traitor as well? Not not Shun, but his brother. And that, that's a little weird now because I'm thinking like, you know, all the brothers would have band together and be like, yes, you know, a team, some ish like that. No, but I'm guessing not because look what the hell is happening right now. But, you know, of course, these two are distractions to get Shun. And who knows what the hell they're going to do next. I'm scared. <laughs> I don't want Shun to fall for it, but of course, because these two are very much important to him, he is going to fall for it, because psh, it happens in almost like any other type of Isekai series, where yeah, not not the love interest, but someone who is important to our main protagonist, yeah, of course they're going to get captured, and he's going to do everything in his power to go get them, yes. Um, I'm also hoping that, you know, Shun... And Wakaba do kind of meet up, maybe. I mean, because, you know, Faye, even though she's still inside of her egg, hopefully she gets out. And maybe, you know, at the time when she does, she, she might get to see Wakaba again. Who knows what the hell is going to happen with this. But, oh, uh, God.
I'm scared because I have no clue what the fuck is going to happen. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 13 of So I'm a Spider, So What. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially on next Friday for episode 14. Bye, guys.